Hello fabulous ones, welcome back to my channel. I am Marlo Keenan, and if you're new here, welcome to the fam. <laughs> Hello fabulous ones, thank, oh my god. Oh my god, I haven't done this in like so long, okay. Hello fabulous ones, welcome to my, oh wait, what, wait. Hello fabulous ones, welcome to my, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Hello fabulous ones, welcome back to my channel. I am Marlo Keenan, and if you're new here, welcome to the Fabulous Family. Today I am super excited because I have not sat down to do a video in a long time. I miss you guys so much and I just can't believe that I'm finally sitting down to film something, okay? So in any event, what I wanted to do today was obviously do this a gorgeous look, but I wanted to use one palette and the palette that I used today was my custom made sugar pill palette. You know, it's a palette that I hardly ever touch and it's not because I don't like the palette or anything like that, it's just because I just have so much in my collection right now, it's very overwhelming. So what I'm gonna be doing is I am not going to do any makeup looks other than for a little while with just my old palettes that I have, haven't used, haven't touched, you know, shopping my stash, so to speak, and all of that good jazz. And I also wanted to put some colors that typically people wouldn't put together. You know what I'm saying? I put a little cut crease right there, but used a total different type of color that I would normally use with a pink and purple look. So I just wanted to get a little bit more creative and do something like that. And then of course the glitter that I used was by Midas Cosmetics and this is their pressed glitters. And I will tell you and show you uh, throughout the video what I use, how I use it and all of that good jazz. So enough jibba jabba, okay? But before you leave, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Now, let's get into the video. Guys, I'm so rusty. You guys have no idea how much I missed you. So I'm going to first go in with my Drawer Cosmetics Clean Canvas Base because I'm using some bright colors and I just want them to pop and this base is really good I keep on telling you guys this it goes a long way if you purchase it you will have it for a long long time and of course you know I'm an affiliate 30% off information down below okay I'm just gonna go ahead and dab that in but I'm not gonna bring it all the way in here because I'm gonna be cutting the crease anyway and I don't want to waste product Okay, like I said, I am only using this one palette. I'm going into this shade right here. I do not know what it's called. It's by Sugar Pill because I can't take it out. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna take this very, very hot pink shade right here. If we could, there we go. This hot pink shade right here. And we're gonna use that as my transitional shade. So let's get to it. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and take this purple that's right here, and I'm gonna put that right on top of that pink shade and blend that all out, and I'm gonna bring it out all in the outer corner, and it's gonna be nice and purpley and smoky.
Okay, now I'm gonna take this black right here and I am gonna smoke that out even further. But I'm gonna use, you know, a pretty fluffy brush for this and it's a small one because I really wanna disperse it very slowly and lightly. It's not like I want it to be like black, black, but I want it to be black enough that it gives the outer corner and the crease a little bit more richness. Now you guys know I'm gonna cut the crease. However, I will clean up the crease first as I'm using such a different color. You know, I don't want the purple to mix in with this green that I'm using. So I'll take a cute tip and while I'm doing this, I'm also creating the line of which I'm gonna cut the crease in and hopefully it comes out the exact same way as this eye. You guys know I be struggling with that, okay? when I do one eye at a time. But we're gonna do our best. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with this green right in the middle and I'm gonna put this more so in the inner corner. Okay guys, now I'm gonna put some glitter glue right there on the top and in, in a corner and I'm gonna use my Midas Cosmetics Press Glitter. I'm gonna use this shade right here. It's called Corrupt. It's super, super pretty. And we're just gonna lay that just a little bit right there in the inner corner just to give it a little something something. All right, so I took the tape off. We're gonna do a little eyeliner and we'll do my lower lash line. Okay, the eyelashes that I'm going to use today is by Makeup Geek, and they are in the style Elegant. They're super, super pretty. I already have this one on. I'm gonna go put that on. We're gonna come back. I'm gonna have my base done, and we're gonna do the lippy together, and then we will have the final look. Mm -hmm. 